Algebra 1, this is Chapter 4, Section 8, and I believe we're going to have six videos in this one. Um, you do want to watch all six of them. Please don't skip them. Um, each one's going to cover something completely different. So the first video here, I'm going to cover basically how to write a matrix equation for a system of equations. Um, and we're going to talk about eventually how to solve these systems of equations by inverses, by triangulating or di doing a diagonal, and how to use the calculator to do matrices. So let's get started with um, our first thing. How do you write a matrix equation for a system of equations? Well, so far you guys have gotten pretty good at um, pulling off the coefficients and writing matrix. So let me get started with writing my... Control C, Control V, copy and paste that thing, flip it over. Okay, so if I write my coefficients here, I can do my 5, my negative 6, my 3, and my 2. Right? So that would take care of what's in our coefficients for x's and our y's. Now I'm going to have another matrix. And I'm going to have to have an equal sign. And then I'm going to have to have a final matrix. So here's how we're going to set this all up. So if I am multiplying, and this is a 2 by 2. This is a 2 by 2. This is going to have to be a 2 by something or other. Well, I have my 5 and my 3 and my 6, negative 6 and 2 accounted for. But I don't have the x's and y's accounted for. So if I actually put my x here and my y here, and I'm multiplying, that would mean my x gets multiplied by my 5 and my y gets multiplied by my negative 6, which would put me back to this 5x minus 6y. And then you take the x times the 3 and the y times the 2, which would get me back to this 3x plus 2y. So the last thing over here would be putting in my negative 47 and my negative 17. And once I've done that, I have written my matrix equation for the, this system of equations. So that's basically the first step is just writing the system of the uh, matrix equation. Okay, so let's, here's the second one. Um, you might want to just pause this right now and try it on your own and then check your answer when you come back. So take a moment. Okay, so hopefully you got started here, and I'm just going to fill this in real quick. So I've got a 1 in front of this x, so that's a 1. I've got a 3 in front of this y, so it's a 3. I've got a 1 in front of this x, so it's a 1. And I've got a 2 in front of this y, so it's a 2. And then I've got my x's and y, so I'm going to have my x and my y. And then I've got my 3 and my 7, so I'm going to have my 3 and my 7. Well, pretty basic. Hopefully you understand how to write your matrix as a system of equations.